leaving Walmart. I just got two phones, straight tuck. 49 a piece. Hey YouTube, what's going on? Ernest here with Burns Resale Shop, feeling like an amateur rookie because I left my business card at home, but they got some sweet deals right now at the Walmart clearance. Uh, Samsung Straight Talk Galaxy 6. I'm going to see if I can put them online and sell them before I get off of work. And if so, I'm about to go buy the rest. Bye. Alright, and that's it. It took a couple of days to sell the phones. Unfortunately, when I went back, they were all gone except for one. And I got it. Alright, excuse the mess, excuse the noise, we've been working, it's been a good weekend, having my son over, we got all the family here, so uh, it's been pretty busy, I haven't got to do much, but uh, we enjoying our weekend at least. And um, I'm going to try the video a little bit different, hopefully it works out, if not, we'll go back to normal, or I might not even use this if it doesn't work out, but we'll see. First off, I have to say, I got my first constructive feedback, I guess you could say. Oh, dude got in touch with me and said, you know what? If you don't wear cut off sleeves, at least have some kind of muscle. What the shit? F that guy, right? Anyways, let's carry on. So I pulled out my fancy pants shirt with the sleeves and we're gonna do the video. Got everything ran down. Oh, and before you think I'm being mean to subscribers, it's just a buddy from school. Mondo took your advice, at least for one video. Got everything written down. We're gonna see how it goes. If it works out, we'll continue this way. All right, overall through the week, I sold 22 items for $574.05. Um, out of the 22 items, I had 12 best offers, but keep in mind all this week, I have my store on a 20% discount. So on all the items I sold, I got a little bit less than what I was asking for. But uh, we're gonna run through them items. I'm gonna try to show them on the screen as we go. And we're gonna get through this real nice and quick all right first off i got the house party dvd i paid a dollar for i took a best offer and got 9.25 walmart clearance i got two uh bike tubes um uh, 15 dollars full asking price i got hello kitty she was kind of big kind of heavy but i took a best offer for 15 dollars i made a few bucks off of that all right remember the car lot i didn't want to get to well i finally got to it and i broke it down to plenty of lots but uh all the leftover Hot Wheels, Matchbox, and a few other cars I put on a big box. 90 of them for a total of $35. So they uh, shipped it uh, priority mail shipping. $13 off of that, so I made about 20 bucks. Even with them, $11.95. Got the whole $11.95. The Dymo uh, Dymo Le Label Maker, $19.95, and I got all of that. Um, oh, my buddy Brando, he hooked me up with the Street Fighter Metal, uh, metal Figs. I got um, $32.50, and that was the best offer. Made a quick $20 profit off of it. Thank you, Brando. All right, Evil Within, again, the very last one. Best offer, $10. See this picture? They're gone. Probably won't get no more of them. I'm glad they're all gone. All right, out of the Hot Wheel car lot to uh, Maisto Diecast. I don't know, they're the lifeguard ones. I got best off for $8. My other calculator I found, this took a few days to sell, but I got $23.96 TI-83 silver, and it had a, a case from a different brand. But yeah, they bought it. They already left good feedback, so I'm happy with that. Me, Wally Sparks. Rare out of print, $10 best offer for this one. Anything with Rodney Dangerfield, pretty much it's out of print. I guess they decided not to make no more of him. I don't know. Most of the ones I find, they are considered out of print. Keep that in mind. Uh, King boots. There are some kid boots. I got $17.56. That, that must have been a 20% off. I don't know. You'll see it in the picture if it is. Um, Dragon Ball Xenoverse. Disc only. I got $11.96 for that. That had to be 20% off. Usually most of my items I put it for dollar amount. $0.95. Cents, like $10.95. $11.95. I don't know. I just like that number I guess. Alright. The phones, it took a couple days to sell, but I took a best offer on the first one for $89. And it was alright, I made a few bucks off that, I believe 25 profit after it's all said and done. Alright, the pants, I got 17 pairs of pants for a dollar each. They're right here, they're all gonna look the same, they were all black pants, but uh, 511 tactical pants, $15, I took a best offer. True spec cargo pants, same, $15, I took a best offer. Oh, and this one, the Samson, I had two watches on it, 
and I guess the second one bought this one right away for full price. I believe I made 35 something profit off of this one. They're $49 a piece by cost. Alright, let's see. Fox boots. These were the dirt bike boots. I believe youth size 5. Anyways, $72. And I believe that is the highest profit item I've had during this whole challenge thing. I'm pretty sure that is. Alright, we almost did it again. Keep with me. Another pair of pants, same thing, same price, same best offer, $15. Miss me jeans. I paid three for these. I put them for $24.95, I believe, and I got $20 off of best offer. And then to set it off, I got two last train sets. Um, the McCall's Chicken Farm train, $11.96. And then I got this motorized, I don't know, it's a motorized train. You'll see it. I think it was a blue one, $15.96. That's it. That's all. Uh, I don't know how that shows up on there, but if it works out, I guess you're seeing it now in the video. Hope you like it. But uh, at the end of everything, what we got, I got a mess here. Everything I bought for the challenge so far is online. I haven't bought nothing this week really, so going forward, I don't know what we're gonna do. I need to get outside, start looking, get on social media, start looking for items. So you amp this up. Total, right now, since I didn't do much spending this week, I got $549.35 to spend, and as far as the challenge challenge goes, I made a total of $709.76 profit. I want to hit that thousand before the month's over. I guess by the next video, uh, I got one week. Let's see if I can make 300 profit. For that to happen, I need to have a lot of good sales and go shopping. But uh. I hope this works out short and sweet. I hope you enjoyed it. Learn something that's a little different as I'm doing it. It doesn't feel like I'm going to keep doing it. But uh, for now, this is what I got. I'll see you on the week.